Man, this dude, Andy Minio right here, he been on his grind in 2020. He's been putting out hella music. So we got more to react to. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano The Third, y'all guys' third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed and you like what you see at the end of the video, consider clicking the subscribe button bottom right-hand corner. Now, if you know me, you know that I'm fond of Andy Minio and his music and his creativity and the effort that he puts in not only to the actual song itself, but the effort that he puts into the overall like atmosphere that surrounds the song. Like, as you know, I was I was one of the reactors in, in his most recent music video, Jackson Pollock. And then on top of that, he made the he made the TikTok remix, which I thought was dope as well. And then with Jackson Pollock and the song before that with Wordsplay, like he he had the entire like that Japanese theme and then he released merch alongside of it. The merch was fire. So it, like the whole creative aspect of everything that surrounds the music is dope. And, and it just adds, it adds a whole nother level. It adds a whole nother level, I guess you could say of submersiveness to the, to the listener. So they're like, damn, I'm completely in this world of Andy Minio, fire. But he dropped another single on us always in a rush featuring mez i don't know who mez is but i did see that he posted like the lyrics the day before that the actual video and the song was released so i was hyped so i'm like there's nothing else to say follow your boy on instagram and on twitter at the third earnest just like the channel the links are down in the description below and he follows me why can't you you know but let's get it I feel guilty every time I watch TV. I feel like bro, that bass line is crazy. Just like the vibe of the the vibe of the instrumental is just like, oh yeah, like that. You know what I'm saying? I feel guilty every time I watch TV. I feel like I ought to be working. I feel mm. like there's things hey, I still wanna be, and it isn't gonna happen if I'm just relaxing. Hey. Ooh, dog, that. Now, I'm always in a rah, 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 and then it echoes out. So fire. It's like fire because it's like the voice sounds like it's screwed up, you know, like chopped and screwed music. Like it sounds like it's like semitones, like it's like they've been taken down and chopped and screwed music or that style of music from the South is like slowed down, but slowed down and always in a rush. Like, bro, that's dope. And in this video, I don't even know how they shot it. Like you can clearly see the creative decision, like the creative, I guess, I guess, yeah, the creative decision. You can clearly see that it looks like it's like it's choppy, I guess you could say, like, like he's moving like very, very, it doesn't look very smooth. And it looks like he's moving faster, but you can, but he's lip syncing to the song at the same time. So it, one, it looks like they, it, I don't know if this is the way I would do it. It looks like they slowed the, the song down. And during the process of shooting the video, he was lip syncing the song at that slower pace, but everything obviously is still in normal speed. And then when they bring it into, bring it into the editing software, they speed it back up to normal. So it looks like, it looks like he's moving in fast motion, but now the lip syncing is normal. I don't know if that's how he did it. That's always the way I think that these things are done. But it, well, what's throwing me off is like the, the fact that it looks like it's dropped frames. It looks very like, it looks very jerky. And that's obviously a creative decision to do that. I just don't know how it's done. And obviously the sentiment of the song is dope. Like I, I feel guilty watching TV because I feel like I, I can't get to my next goal if I'm wasting time watching TV. And I feel like that too, now that I'm full-time YouTube. Like I feel like I'm, I'm wasting my time if I'm watching shows and I'm watching TV, like I'm just sitting there. It's no longer a relaxing thing whenever you're like working for yourself, you know? But just pay attention to how it looks like he's like moving quickly, but the song is obviously in his mouth is no moving in normal speed. And I also like the fact that he's like, he's over exaggerating his mouth movement so that way it looks even more choppy. It looks more robotic. So much I wanna accomplish. I don't need no yeah. accomplice. I might need to see doctors. When I'm not seeing progress, my mind gets stuck. When I need this, I might need to see doctors. I don't need no accomplice. When I'm not feeling progress, my mind gets stuck. That's that burnout that people talk about, especially with people who are creatives, because you always feel like you gotta be putting out new content or you're falling behind. Sometimes the stresses that you would normally expect in a job are like amplified because you know that you're the one that's you're the one that's holding you back by not constantly working. It's like that that's the way burnout is real. Stop. I'm always in a rush. Gotta crack a few eggs to make omelets, I guess. I wonder if I could break ground without no breakdown. My mind ain't no prison, no, it's a playground. Wonder how long my fan base stay down. Yeah. Duh, 
else. He see all these different like questions and all, like these are questions that bring stresses into the creative field. Like even right here, like how long will the fans stay down? How long will people watch me for? How long will people subscribe on Patreon for to be able to keep me like doing this and for y'all guys? Like there's all these questions that add extra pressure. So that's why he says sometimes like I wish that I could not I wish I wonder if I could break ground before I break down like that. That's a that's a serious question that goes through everybody's head as doing anything that that people consume. You got to be fresh. You got to be innovative. You got to be speedy. You got to be timely, like all these different things that that cause these mental breakdowns and panic states, you know, wonder how long my fan base stay down. Yeah, worry this clock gonna stop. That this heart won't take. Missing what I got for things I still ain't get. You uh, won't take no shots if you scared to miss. Oh shit, I thought he drove into a cloud. <laughs> he said, scared my heart gonna stop, that the clock won't tick, missing the things that I got for the things I still ain't get. I, like, I need to smell the roses while they're right here in front of me. But I'm looking past my accomplishments that I should be thankful for right now because I'm still trying to get somewhere else. So it's like you can't you can't enjoy the things you have now because you're always you're always trying to go to the next thing. That's the way I feel with the channel right now. Like I should feel thankful that I have 137,000 subscribers on the channel, but like I know that I can't stop there. I gotta get to the next thing. So it's like I can't I can't take the moment to enjoy where I'm at right now, you know? I just hope time is on my side. Ooh, boy, don't think I don't see them Yeezys, dog. I just hope time is on my side. Mm. I wish there was more. I wish. I wish there uh. was more. I wish in the day. I wish there was more. Hold up. Did I just realize like right now that this whole that this is a one shot like a like one long take? Let me go back and look. Yeah, bro, it looks like it's all one take. Yo, I love one take videos. What what I already forgot which video I said it is once. Oh, it was the Justin Bieber Lonely, how it like it brings you into the world that they're trying to bring you into because of the fact that there's no cuts. Because you can't cut in real life, you know, so like you're it's like you're there with him right now. I wish there was more. I wish. I wish there was more. Important, but I swear dog that 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 B switch up right there, like the chop, like they chopped it up to and before the next dude comes in, Mez, I assume. Yo. Yeah, things be important, but I swear that it don't be time for it. Kill for some time. I do yeah. what Instagram did divine for it. When I was younger, I would dog he said kill for some time i'm gonna do what instagram did to vine for it dog like but instagram basically killed vine and didn't really kill snapchat because people use snapchat but instagram is definitely the bigger of the three and vine just completely disappeared he said things be important but i swear there ain't just no time for it and we're talking about always in a rush dog Vine for it. When I was younger, I would waste it, won't thinking twice for it. Back when dunks used to just be dunks and it won't no line for him. Rush hour on the 440. They say dunks used to, used to just be dunks and there wasn't no line for him. Dog, I fight like he's talking about shoes, like like sneakers. Back when dunks used to just be dunks and it won't no line for him. Rush hour on the 440, I take a drive for it. Hey, yeah. Rappers swear they got love for the streets and all their lines. Oh, whoa, hold up. I just realized that we're like, we're in this other scene and how did they transition that? Because we're obviously still on the one take that I don't know how they did that. We're gonna go back and see. Cause I wasn't paying, I wasn't, I was listening to the lyrics. I wasn't paying attention to the, to the smoothness of the transition in the video. For it, kill for some time. I do yeah. what Instagram did divine for it. When I was younger, I would waste it. Won't thinking twice for it. Back when dunks used to just be dunks and it won't no line. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. You can see it right there where they cut from like the video. And then the, you can see that the camera like cuts and, and it gets slightly bigger before they pull out. All right, all right, I see it now. Still, that was fire to the point where I didn't even realize that it happened. I'm normally looking out for those type of transitions because I want to break down the music video, but I didn't even see it right there. And then they go right into the next screen and then that's that's like the next portion of the video because the dude left his house and now he's like doing Instagram live from, yo, fire, bro. No line for him, rush hour on the 440, I take a drive for it. Hey, yeah. I'm always in a rush trying to get home. Rappers swear they got love for the streets and all their lines quoted. Look like it touch people, but it don't. It's like a mom wrote it on the internet. They yeah. rush your greatness, bunch of cons on it. Never tell you to your face, they sub like Jimmy John's on it. Bro, it's here. It was it's Andy looking at his phone, dog. Holy shit. Woo boy.
that's 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 money and he said these rappers claim that they know the streets and people quoting all their lyrics but really they're just mimes for it like they're just mimicking somebody else or mimic they're mimicking somebody else authenticity you know but i didn't even realize we were looking at andy's hands right here but it don't it's like yeah, a mom wrote it on the internet they yeah. were so great and it's bunch of cons on it never tell you to your face they sub like bro john's on it just the effect, dog. Like, I'm sorry I'm pausing it so much, but like, like, how are we looking from Andy's perspective if we're looking at the camera right now and the camera is not behind Andy? Like, how many takes did they do to get the to get the image and then they probably green screen Andy in right here? They did the ball thing so that way it looks like I don't I don't know how they did it, bro, but that that is super clean. People been looking for the dog in me where they is. <gasps> Been in a rush for all my spiritual engagements. Yeah. Been in a rush to get my diamonds off my veins. Uh. Been in a rush to spread the love, but love ain't say when. I just hope time is on my side. Bro, those two verses, just the just the smoothness and just like how they came in so relaxed and saying important things, but it's just like such a it's such a smooth delivery. You know what I'm saying? Like yo. I just hope time is on my side. I wish there was more. I wish. I wish there uh. was more. I wish. <laughs> I wish there was more. I wish. I wish there was more. Yeah. Bro, you see how like the whole video right there, like Oh, hold up. Was that a dream sequence the whole time? But yeah, I think it was because like he fell asleep at at the uh, at the desk, but he fell asleep and and this whole situation was a dream. But yo, it's dope. Did you see like that entire time how he uh, while he was in the truck, like he basically spent the entire work day. The sun went down from the sunrise when he got in the car. Yo. And then the whole concept of just like not having enough time in the day and feeling the pressure from time while he's sitting at his office desk, like in his chair and the sun goes down on him. Like he was at work literally eight, nine hours of the day. And there's not, that means there's not enough time left because he was busy working. Bro, this dude, Andy, the director, they just don't miss, bro. The creativity. The fact that I was stumped, like from the very beginning of what happened in the video, how they how they did like the animated, like the very quick mo motions, but very choppy, and then we and then I missed it. I'm to the point where I missed it was an entire long take, and then also I missed how they did the transition from the screen or from Andy to the screen, and then the screen to Instagram, and then from that back into the screen. Like, how did I miss all those things? That's how that's how you know that they were done hella smooth because you don't even realize that they're happening yo this one was fire once again i'm gonna need a new album andy like asap rocky but yo that brings us to the end of this video ladies and gentlemen if you like what you see please consider liking the video leaving a comment down below if you like what you see enough please consider subscribing the likes the comments the subscriptions they all help the algorithm push the channel out there for other people to view so that way we can grow this family a little bigger follow your boy on instagram and on twitter at the third earnest just like the channel hit up the discord if you want to talk to me and other people who are subscribed the discord is the best place to do it so check that out also linked in the description but that's all that i got for you today ladies and gentlemen i appreciate your time and like i always say at the very end of all of my videos go out there in the world love and care for one another love and care for each other and i'll catch everybody in the next video peace